Hello, welcome to the Roy Rogers channel with your host, Roy Rogers. Today, I would like to introduce you the pre-evolution, not the evolution, but the pre-evolution of the fast fire type. And when I mean fast, I mean fast. This Pokemon is known for speed. I mean, seriously, the, 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 it's no joke. You can. I'll go ahead and link its full evolution, actually, as well as its pre-evolution. Well, mm, you know what? I'll just go ahead and link the full evolution. Then I'll read the decks of the pre-evolution. Just say, just say my my facts can be just a little bit more accurate. Anyway, yeah. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and endorse this. This is the fastest fire type in the game. Poida. Now. Uh, there we go. Pokedex. P. There we go. Okay. Actually, no, wait. I'm going to be doing the... Uh, that one. Okay. Just so it can be a little bit more accurate. Okay, I'm going to read the decks of the pre-evolution. Okay, so... Rapidash. Rapidash. Not Paida. Rapidash. Rapidash, um, like I said, the speed is power. I mean, li seriously. the This, back then in Generation 1, this thing was the fastest. And when I mean fast, I mean like turbo fast. Like almost like, like, like this horse moved first. Like about... 80% of the time. That says a whole lot. And then even in Gen 2, it's even fast. I mean, heck, I mean, whenever we only got the breeding move, Hypnosis, I mean, in, in Gen 2, don't don't tell a bunch of people, but I actually I used the Hypnosis to kind of beat some NPCs. They didn't even know I even use it. In fact, the Pokemon Stadium, this is so funny. I migrate the Pokemon, or Rapidash that learns hypnosis, guess what? The NPCs don't expect me to do hypnosis. Boom! Hit them with hypnosis, make them go to sleep, and then the fire spin begins. That's my secret to how to beat Pokemon Stadium. Now Rapidash is not even close to the best pokes in the game. So, um, the stats, uh, yeah not too hot and special attack uh, that's actually really bad switch because Rap um, Rapidash or Paida is supposed to be a uh, fire type right right fire last time I checked in gen 3 it was special so knowing this why are the stats switched? I mean, let's like, should shouldn't shouldn't the uh, um, uh, one hundred flip to to an eighty on the attack? I mean, that that would make a whole lot more sense since it's a it's a special poke. I mean, it's it's like it's like me saying that that I'm gonna give uh, I don't know. Cloister a, def a boost in its defenses. I don't know why, but just give it a boost on its physical defense. Not its special defense, which most pokes hit it with. No, just the physical defense. Yeah. Then you get a bad combo that will probably not end up in tournaments. Now, if you see why I don't like using Rapidash, that's the reason. I mean, back then... I I used to love using it because it used to be really fast and and yeah used to have one of the best stats around. Now it doesn't really. So yeah, as far as move sets are concerned, there's not much of a variety it can actually learn. You could I would suggest making it learn fire spin. Fire spin can be a real torture you can really make your opponent stuck in the battlefield. Oh, oh, 
Hit, don't, not just that, also hit your opponent with a toxic and then fire, fire spin. That would be torture. That would be like, almost like, uh, I don't know. Um, if, if Magmar, even Magmar, oh, it's fire type. Hit it with a fire spin. Toxic, fire spin. Boom. You, you will be the master of the battlefield. If Rapidash, you will be a Rapidash taunt, if anything. Oh, and uh, even better, do a sunny day. And then for any of those non-fire types or any water types, hit it with a solar beam. Boom! You hit it. You hit your opponent with a solar beam. You hit... The cloister with the solar beam, cloister is over. He's gone. That's it. Finish. Cloister done. He is he is toast. Um Iron Tail, that's excellent, especially um especially against ground types. Well, not, yeah. Uh, but it depends on your rapidash if he's physical or special. If he's physical then use the iron tail. If he's special, use the solar beam. Now, I would suggest flamethrower over fire blast because flamethrower, you kind of know it, it'll hit. It'll hit. Don't worry. It will hit. And, not only that, but also, uh, can also uh, um, really there's actually a TM called psycho boost huh wonder what dark shades gonna be coming up with the next okay anyway yes you can make it learn attract also because like most po pokes people for some reason have an obsession with male pokes so if you have a female then you can teach your poke attract just so you can taunt your pokes the best part here's the best part you can make your move set fire spin toxic attract and um and for uh oh i don't know like like just in case your opponent is in the red like he's like literally in the red don't wait for him to, um, to, to, uh, to do, to do a, an attack on you. Just do quick attack, and you'll knock him out instantly. Quick attack, toxic, fire blast, er, fire blast, fire spin. I'm gonna do the moves all over again. Quick attack, toxic, fire spin, and attract. That is your move set write it down quick attack you can read that fire spin write that down too toxic write that down too and wait for it wait for it and write this down too there we go and there are your attacks You can also write down the description if you like, which is why I'm actually putting it on a little bit longer than normal. Okay, now, attract. Uh, there we go, just so you can read the, so, the description over there. Okay. Now, since I'm endorsing Paida for someone, I'm going to go ahead and put on Paida's picture now. That'd be even a good move set for Paita too, by the way. If you all have to use Paita, that'd be a good move for move set for it too. Hopefully y'all wrote down that move set there. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. Um I got some music for you. Uh but first off, I have to say this. Disclaimer. Disclaimer. 
I did not construct this music by myself. This is by Tom and Jerry Fist of Fury. Uh, I think this is the jazzy tune, I think. Like, at the time I was recording it, I think I was by the dumpster area. I'm not too sure if you all know where that is. But yeah, anyway, I do... The, this is not my music. This is Tom and Jerry's music. That's a disclaimer. Okay, let's go ahead and, and uh, let's get to the music now. I figured this, this older tune would be a little bit more fitting for, for a horse, since a horse is technically, uh, you know, diplomatic. You know, like uh, like back then, how the, gen how the gen uh, gentlemen ride horses. That's where I got the idea from, by the way. Okay, I'm going to go and play the tune now. body is light and its leg and its legs are incredibly powerful it can clearly uh, it can clear um, airs rock in one leap interesting this Pokemon must uh, jump pretty high that's for sure what are we talking about? This is a horse. It's supposed to do that. Okay. Uh, yeah, that that was obvious. Okay. Um. Can I mention anything else? Not really. Other than its other than its uh thing is in speed. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, uh, this is Roy Rogers' channel coming in, and thank you, Easy Roll, for linking your shiny poida. I do have to give credit to you. And this is the Roy Rogers channel for coming in. Thank you for watching this video. Please comment or subscribe to my channel. Um, let's see. Mm. Oh, uh, like or dislike this video. And this is Roy Rogers coming in.